I was one of 700 men stuffed into the forward and aft holds of the Japanese ship, the Haromaru. We were part of a nine ship convoy with Japanese de destroyer escort headed for Japan. We no sooner left Manila Bay than we came under submarine attack. The holds were covered. We, were, we remained in complete darkness. All we heard was the detonating uh, depth charges from the Japanese destroyers and the constant swerving and zigzagging of the ship they were on. We spent 18 horrendous days and nights running all over the South China Sea being chased by American submarines. <coughs> On the 18th day, we pulled into the Hong Kong Harbor. At that time, I didn't know it was Hong Kong, but two years ago when I gave a talk here, one of the gentlemen approached me and said uh, his dad had been on the Haromaru, and he showed me a picture of the ship in the harbor. When we pulled into the harbor, I happened to be by the ladder. The hold was uncovered, and a Japanese guard wanted two men to come to topside. I scrambled up the ladder, grabbed the water holes, drank, drank, doused myself, filled my two canteens, put them back on my belt, drank some more, and I began filling canteens and water bottles as they sent them up from the holes. This went on for about four hours. Finally, the air raid sirens went off. Back down a hold, the hold was covered, and off again we went. Seven days later, we ended up in Taiwan. 700 miles from where we started. We stayed in Taiwan for, I think, about four weeks. Then we were loaded on the Japanese cruise liner, the Melbourne Maru. The Japanese had uh, confiscated this ship uh, at the beginning of the war. And they put 300 British soldiers on the ship with us. Do you know what the main recreation is for the British soldier, anybody? He sings. He sings day and night. <laughs> I rem vaguely remember some of the words from one of the songs. The cruise ship was leaving Bombay, heavily laden with time expired men, bound for the land they adore. There will be no promotion this side of the ocean, so cheer up, my lad, bless them all. The long, the, the long, the and the, the tall and the shore. Anyway, that's what they say. <laughs> but some of the words, some of the words were a little different because the British soldier, boy, he just swears all the time, all the time. I do. Mean.